According to interviews published in Andy Green's book, The Office, The Untold Story of the Greatest Sitcom of the 2000s, Carell had told NBC Brass that he planned on signing a new office contract that would be good, quote, for another couple of years. According to Ferry, however, a network executive simply didn't reach out to him about negotiating a new deal. He planned on staying on the show. He told his manager, and his manager contacted NBC and said he's willing to sign another contract for a couple years. So all of that was willing and ready and on their side honest. And the deadline came for when NBC executives were supposed to give him an offer, and it passed, and they didn't make him an offer. She continued, noting that Carell didn't want to leave the office behind. He simply had no other choice. Carell was like, look, I told them what I want to do. I don't want to leave. I don't understand. It just is mind-boggling how that happened, and I feel bad because I think a lot of people think he did leave the show on his own merit, and it's absolutely not true. I'm telling you, he really wanted to stay, and it devastated all of us because he was the heart of our show.